the three reasons why giving him space increases his desire. That's what we're talking about today. And I'm not only going to give you the three reasons why giving him space increases his desire. I'm going to give you why that is under a large umbrella of understanding men in a way that you may not have heard before. So I want you to be sure to understand that giving him space does not have to entail giving him large chunks of time away from you. That's not what giving him space has to be understood in a way that makes you feel uncomfortable, anxiety ridden, etc. So stick around so that you understand exactly what it entails and why when you give him the space you are going to increase his desire that's the beauty of this this is intrinsically male and why if I were coaching men I would not be telling them anything of the sort so who am I to talk about this I am coach Paula grooms a dating and relationship coach for women, licensed social worker, and author of the book, Why Won't He Commit? How a Man Decides to Make You the One. Through my coaching, I help you find or reunite with a man you truly desire, inspire his continued interest to create the relationship of your dream so you receive the complete commitment you totally deserve. So let's get to reasons one and two. Three is a big one and the why at the end of this video is so important. But before we do all that, please, if you like this video, subscribe if you have not and hit the red alert bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. This material is very important for you to understand so you succeed with men. That's what I'm all about and why I'm here giving this to you today. So let's get to reason number one. First, we have to look at what space is. It is air. Space is air and air allows fire to continue to burn. If you think of it in this way, you will really help yourself to continue to stoke the flames of his interest in you. And the second and third are going to go more into this, especially the why is this? You may be thinking, why does he even need to take space? Or why do I even need to be thinking about it? You do because you are female in this instance, and we are wanting you to get what you want, which is his continued interest attention, affection, etc. And space for a man creates that. And number two is really going to go into more about that. But just keep that in your mind that space is air and air continues to fan the flames for him. Okay. Space equals air. And again, it's not a lot of space. I'm not talking about big chunks of time. It can be as simple as just not texting him, allowing him the space to come to you and text you. You know, if you follow my work at all, how intrinsic a man's pursuit is to his love. Giving him the space and time to do that is the most loving thing you can do as a woman with a man to allow him to feel manly. And this kind of uh, goes into number two. And number two is really anthropological in a way and expounds on why a man needs space. He needs the space to regulate himself in a way that you really don't. And here's why I believe that is intrinsically in the male and female beings. So females, from the time we've been cave women, we have relied on being in groups for protection. 
we relied on other women, we coexisted in ways related to childcare that men did not. They went off and hunted. And a lot of times this was alone. So not only does he not have the same need that you do for that kind of more clannish connection, almost what he can deem as clinging, because he needs more space. Men love things like fishing. Think about that. You go off alone in large spaces and sit there quietly. It is simply intrinsic in the male being to need space and it helps regulate him in a way that you're going to be the recipient of that regulation. So it is a gift. Think of it as a gift and you will help yourself. And now we get to number three. Space creates novelty. Think about you have a favorite pair of shoes or outfit and you have kept it for quite a long time and you may have put it maybe in the back of your closet and you didn't think about it then you found it again and you put it on it feels known and comfortable and gives you a great feeling almost a reminder of it and this comfy comfortable feeling but it's the space that you allowed that helps create that feeling when you put it on again. In other words, if you were to wear it every day, it would kind of wear out its welcome in a sense. And it's just a way for you to think about this so you get the concept of the need for some space in a way that you don't feel the need for. It has nothing to do with how much He wants you or loves you or anything. And if you put it under that lens, you are going to do yourself a disservice. So I'm going to get to now the big umbrella of the why of all of this. So you truly understand males in a way that is going to help you increase his desire for you through your gift of giving him these things that you know about him that men love in a way that is different than the way women love. This is all in my book. Very important for you to really get and incorporate in your psyche so you relate to your man through these these concepts and this one in particular. So I have it in my book and I say it a lot but it bears repeating all the time because if you don't get this you really can go off course in not understanding men in this way that will help you enormously get what it is that you desire and deserve and give him what he desires and deserves which is a relationship with you love connection affection he does want all that and men need it really is never before in our society that is is so fraught with the issues we have now and loneliness men's loneliness in particular so it's a real gift and you will set yourself apart when you understand this so we as women love through knowing we want to know that the love is there and solid and We want to discuss it and and, and know it like we know our name and verify it and confirm it and all manner of things related to the knowing that the love is true and trustworthy and there. And this isn't about being anxious or not, not at all. It's just intrinsically female because we are the connectors, the cooperators, the caretakers of the world. Men love differently and why they need space and why giving them space creates their love and increases their desire. Men love through wondering and longing. And this can be hard for women, who love in a totally different way, to conceptualize. How can you love through wondering and longing easily? For example, when you go out into nature, you go out into nature, you get a wonderful feeling of wonder. It's not confusion, 
It's not guessing anything. It's just a feeling of awe and wonder. You don't know what you don't know, but it feels great to be in it. You can feel love through wondering when you look into your pet's eyes. They can't talk to you and you don't really know what they're thinking. You can kind of feel maybe what they're perhaps feeling or you're imbuing them with that feeling, but you don't know. It's a wonder. This is the way that men love. And because they love in this way, giving them the space that I just outlined is so significant to him continuing to love you through wondering and longing. And again, not in big ways. It can be as simple as making him wait for a return text, not having to see him all the time or feeling like you need to to validate what's going on. When you understand these concepts, you get men in a way that alleviates a lot of your anxiety. And that's what I'm all about. It gives you the space, in a sense, to allow for him to come to you and allow for your relationship to unfold like an onion. So understand these three ways that giving him space increases his desire for you because it creates novelty. It feels comfy and cozy to him and better than any other thing that you know might be catching his attention. You don't have to worry about that because you get this concept. Understand that the space is air helping to fan the flames of his desire and that space regulates him in a way that when given to him he will appreciate and when he's away from you taking some of that space he may be regulating and allow for that to happen that is natural to men men do not generally seek out others for comfort in a way that we do as women we want to talk immediately when something is going on for us. We want to connect with other women and deal with it then. Men, they don't. They go to their man cave, take time alone, regulate, make their decision, and then they come out and they're much more responsive to you because of that regulation. Get these three reasons why for space and then understand it under the larger umbrella of why and you will do yourself a huge favor and your man will love you for it. Repeat this video as many times as you need and you will help yourself and him to move into the relationship that you both will love and he will revere you for it. Check out this video here. If your man is pulling away because you did not give him the space when he needed it, have no fear because when you give him that space now and watch this video as well as repeat this one, you will get it. Put your comments below, give it a like, and I will see you next time.